A large Suncoast employer has taken to social media over his frustration with Sarasota County. The Evie's restaurant chain owner says he's having to reduce the number of workers at the new Osprey location due to county interference. ABC 7's Ray Collins joins us with both sides of this story. Ray. Haley, the Evie's chain moved to the waterfront at Spanish Point earlier this year in Sarasota County, and they say so far it hasn't been easy. Sometimes I feel like I don't have a bar. This is the new tiki bar and restaurant at Spanish Point. Regular customers like Tom and Marilyn love the new rendition. We enjoy it because we have the intercoastal waterway, a nice breeze, and it's so close to our home. But don't let this easy breezy appearance fool you. Behind the scenes, the owner is frustrated. It just seems like we keep running into too many roadblocks at this location. We caught up with Evie's owner, Mike Evanoff, at his relatively new location on Main Street in downtown Sarasota. Evanoff says the county has been cracking down on everything from different zoning in different parts of the parking lot to too many seats. The old owner had 200 seats there. We tried to do what the old owner had, and then we got slammed down with the 100 seats. Consequently, he says with half the seats, they'll only need half the workers here. We're in the process of trying to put them in other locations. Evanoff took his complaints to Facebook on Wednesday, and even he was surprised at the hundreds of responses he received within hours. But he's not backing down. A lot of violations keep being thrown at us. We reached out to Sarasota County Commissioner Charles Hines, who covers the Osprey area, and he says he didn't have time to talk to us today. The county spokesman also wouldn't speak on camera, but did release the following statement. At this time, Sarasota County Code Enforcement staff is following up on a citizen complaint and working with the business owners and their representatives to ensure there are no violations. Regular customers like Marilyn and Tom hope things get worked out. How often do you come here? As much as we can. <laughs> as much as they can. Evanoff is talking to lawyers now. The county says more meetings are planned as early as tomorrow. And Ray, I saw on that social media post they plan to lay off 25 workers at the Spanish Point location, but in the interview, he said that wouldn't be the case. Yeah, he thinks they can uh, shift workers to his other properties and avoid the layoffs. And said, he says between their restaurants, car wash, valet parking business, and spa and salon, they have over 400 workers in the Evie's empire. Yeah, and diverse uh, uh, employment there. Yes. All right, thank you, Ray.